say, yo, all the jewels you say you dropping, I need to see proof of it. You swelling up on the guard like I ain't used to it. The way of Islam is older than the universe. Before the caveman emerged, you ain't know you was first. Giving birth to a ghost is what they do in church. I'm never off on the Sabbath, I'm always doing work. Giving sight to the blind, it ain't an easy task. Watch the snakes when they slide with their greasy ass. I hit the block as a juvie, cause I needed cash. Rolling up with the savages, smoking weed and hash. All praise to the Most High for giving life. Bust shots at them faggot devils for living trife. This is underground railroad rap. You can't address it properly, then the mail goes back. Make sure you stay up out them jail clothes, black. You ain't a gangster, young blood. That's how them pale folks act. You say you G-O-D, I need to see the evidence. You jumping, shouting, and praising, thinking it's reverence. You steady praying to a mystery in the sky. Because what they told you in your history, it's a lie. I'm spitting high-tech, intelligent bars. You only rap about pushing these irrelevant cars. That China white, they still selling it hard with pounds of green bottled up like relish in jars. Blue break, beat Flores, ultimate breaks and beats. The way I was raised, you only held accountable for what you know. Check it, they try to tell me the original man. He wasn't born on this indigenous land. I give them pilgrims a hand, they be resilient when they're building the plan. I got the skills to reveal it's a scam, so here I am. It's more a science and the more you apply it, The more these devils find it hard to deny The more they won't even try it The more they won't be stealing deeds and hide it Because the Moors won't be bringing the right Check it, they try to tell me that Osama was guilty for 9-11 They got filthy rich and bombed them to heaven He wasn't on that was alone because they killed him They killed all his brethren in sediment see So nobody can see hmm. They said Obama's not a citizen, shit is in disarray Cause they got innocent immigrants living in fear every day They be shivering and slipping these bitter politicians And they be getting them to work for less of pay They try to tell me that the earth is alone in the universe But we're the first to burst upon it To use it, the birth of component The moment that we surface, we knew we can Work it, this service is purpose, though these devils try to hurt it They try to tell me they're no alien beings But I'm the only alien they be seen But I ain't scary and green The melanin be having scary and fleeing Because they fear that I'll appear in their dreams Boom. Huh. They try to tell me, serve the God of my enemy Scarring and killing me Then they tell me God is a friend of me Honestly, is it me? Do I need to honor my enemies? Deities who doing rituals to stop up my energy they try to tell me that the voodoo that you do is doo-doo But who do you call when the voodoo that you do is all you ever perform? Now they tell you that voodoo is wrong But I bet it's strong and my cuckoo to mention at all They tell my children that it's Adam and Eve and Adam and Steve But they don't say the Adam and we It's Adam and Lee Divine so the Vatican be Just backing the priest and lying and attacking our seeds uh, They try to tell me that the balance of life Can be preserved without me having a wife I'm here to challenge the hype I speak the truth, I'm not the arrogant type You in the dark I'm here to carry the light Check it They try to tell me that nobody is living in 2012 So you gotta be kidding Too many devils with a cosmic opinion But who the hell knows the proper intentions Of the Mayans and what they forgot to mention They try to tell me I was born on this planet But damn it, they sampled the granite From the spot that we landed in Kamen And you'll understand it That they managed to damage our ability to ascend it Now our spirit is stranded huh. They say the melanin will never be better or relevant Than any devil who's excelling and drilling in medicine to bring the terror in this era but never again Cause we are the beginning to know there is never an end They say I'm mortal but I live through the blood I live through the stars, I live through the mud I live through the bars from portal to portal I live through the planet on Mars And I order will show you I'm royal you immortal from God They try to tell me that my skills are diminished I'm finished but I give a knock to the business You be the witness, I'm popped to the finish And you know the top is the limit You couldn't stop I got books and stuff, you know, I'm working on and uh, other material. Right now, I'm up here building with the brothers, trying to work on this uh, battle rap, you know, uh, conscious battle rap, something that's totally different from what the average mind could comprehend. Because a lot of people come up to me and they ask me, what is conscious battle rap? So that's basically, you know, I'm uh -huh. here to build with the brothers today and just, you know, go into a little bit of that. And, uh, you so know. Tell, so tell us, brother, like, what, what, is, what is your position in the... Uh in the in the conscious battle rap arena, what what is your what is your position? Like, what do you do? Do you do you spit? Do you organize? What is it that you do? Yes, sir. Yeah, I'm a um, MC. You know, I've been doing this for since I was a teenager. 
But um, yeah, I'm a rapper myself, you know, and I use my 5% of name, you know, Day Son of Law, you know, for my, you know, bars and my music, you know what I'm saying? Brother Fahim is more, you know what I'm saying, the author, you know, when I'm, you know what I'm saying? But Day Son of Law is just, you know what I'm saying, if you get on YouTube, I got a few videos, a couple freestyles on there and stuff like that where it's just all conscious, you know, when you listen to people like Common, Nas, J Electronica, you know, uh, Lupe Fiasco, you know, I'm trying to mostly put a light on those type of MCs to bring them more out into the forefront because too much like you know me and the brother Sarnetta was talking and you know everything is gun bars gun bars everybody talking about you know and they pointing at the other MC with a rifle or you know uh -huh. I'm trying to get rid of that and bring back more of the spiritual aspect more of the consciousness to it to make people when they when they when they leave a battle they go and say wow I ain't know the Bible said that let me uh -huh. let me go check that out so that's what we basically trying to bring back you know the consciousness and the music Indeed. Okay. So, um, in, in your experience, do you think that there are enough people out there, like, in the conscious, not, I'm not even going to say battle rap area, but just conscious MCs that we can put this league together that, that could, that could uh, make this league successful? I think once it pops off people will support it because again you know i was building with the brother and it's like everybody who i've told this idea to the first question is how does that like conscious battle rap like how does that happen how does that work so you know i like to use the uh the example of nas and jay-z you know uh -huh. for example back when they had their little you know back and forth thing and you know uh uh, uh jay-z you know came out with the e uh not ether but uh uh what was it uh, where he was dissing Nas or whatever, but Nas rebuttal with Ether. When Nas came out with Ether, it was more like consciousness. You know, some of the stuff that Nas was saying in there was just stuff that make the average person sit back and be like, wow, I ain't know that. Right. You know, for instance, he was like, uh, one of the balls, he said, uh, Rockefeller died of AIDS, that was the end of his chapter. And that's the guy y'all chose to name your company after? Get it together. I rock hoes, y'all rock fellas. You know, People probably never even knew that, you know right. what I'm saying? But the ignorant person would be like, oh, Rockefeller, yeah, they got money, oh, wow, yeah, we gonna name our set Rockefeller. But, you, you know, these niggas is cross dresses, faggots, doing whatever else, and you've never looked at your history and studied the information on certain things, so you wouldn't know that. So, basically, I like to use that as a perfect example of a conscious MC where, uh -huh. even though he wasn't going up against another conscious MC, and that's a whole nother discussion about Jay-Z and the whole 5% of thing. Right, right. But, uh... It just showed that intelligence, basically, at the end of, end of the day, is going gonna, is gonna to outweigh the right. negativity. Jay-Z's rebuttal was, you know, what was it? I left a condom in your mom, your baby mom's backseat, or, you know, super ugly. What was the, you know, but right, nothing right, dealing right. with consciousness, nothing to make people say, wow, oh, man, you know. So, again, that's what we're trying to bring back, man. Every bar is something that's going to make people sit back and reflect. Right. Do you, do you think, like, this is... Um like a viable alternative to the to the rap music that's out there because to me the lyrics there's a subconscious element Message. to the music you understand what i'm saying True and subconsciously it brings out certain behaviors in people True do you think if we could get this music to the forefront give this music a platform that we might be able to like cause some type of change in the social structure of black people and how we deal with one another oh, yeah. I mean to me that would be like the goal oh yeah definitely one of the names I had chosen you know and you know we playing around with different names but one of the names I had chosen was Underground Railroad Rap TV uh -huh. you know and if you know anything about the Underground Railroad friend and, of a friend you know yeah you know what I'm saying I mean it was a message in you know when they would come and gather slaves and stuff to make uh -huh. their escape or whatever you know they would have messages you know what I'm saying, within the music or within the song. Right. That's right, basically right. what we're doing today. The white man knows basically that the message in hip hop, it can change a person, it can make them better, or it can it can make a person degenerate. Right. The type of music that we hear today is degenerate. It's vile. It's right, stuff that, right. you know, 14, 15 year olds they hear and they run out here and they wild out. It's not making nobody pick up a book. Right. Back when I was coming up, you know what I'm saying, it was cool to be quote unquote like they say a nerd or like wow he knows a lot of stuff he always in books reading and you know you know with the five percenters getting knowledge yourself and the brothers you know the distance of the sun and the moon and the the weight of the planet earth and the you know what i'm saying that's all good you know we want to bring that back you know what i'm saying because right now we're completely missing that 
Right. So definitely there's a message, a vibratory message in the music that it relates to African people. We're vibratory people. Right. You know what I, mean? I remember coming people. up, you had Poor Righteous Teachers, you had X-Clan. Mm. Um, now that those type of groups have seemed to have fallen by the wayside. Yeah. And yeah. you don't have any of those type of groups. Right. And, I, and to me, that's like the point where we lost control of our in, of the rap industry. Yeah, true indeed. You true know what indeed. I'm saying? It's like other ethnic groups came in, took control of the of that industry, that genre of music, yeah. and now this is what we have. Yeah, yeah. I mean, what you see today on the mainstream level back in the days was really uh, underground. Right. You know, shake your ass and all this, and the, right. you know that right. was underground. You hear that when you go out to the clubs when you're 21 and over and you're old enough to drink and go. Right. You didn't hear that over the mainstream radio right. waves. Right. You know right. what I'm saying? But the devil again knows the effect of you know. Uh, uh, the, the the message and the music that the MCs are putting in there, you know, people talk about this Illuminati and you know, I mean, to clear that up real plain and simple, you down with the Illuminati if you teaching death and destruction to your people, right? Unknowingly, but right. you're down with the Illuminati it's when the, the dude says, "Yo, Jay Z down with the Illuminati." Well, yeah, he is down with the Illuminati, but he don't know it. You don't you think he knows it? He he. He's probably been, I, I hear artists talk about, yeah, he's been approached and stuff like He might have been approached before, uh -huh. but my thing is, well, you know what? Let me change that. He knows it. Okay. He knows it. Okay. Other little artists now who may not be as big as a Jay-Z or a Beyonce or a Nicki Minaj or whoever, right. they may not know it, but the devil lets them go. He allows them to do what they're doing because mm -hmm. their message is still... It's, so, per, it's so perpetuating burners, what clap. they want to do. Yeah, yeah, you know what I'm saying? So as long as you're preaching that death, mm -hmm. you have the mark of the beast on you. Right. The 666, the Most Honorable Elijah Muhammad explained that perfectly to us, right. what 666 means. Right. When you're preaching death and destruction to your people, you're down with the Illuminati. Unknowingly, you're down with them. Right. If you ever want to know if the Illuminati, do they exist? How, how do a rapper know that they exist? Go out there and preach co consciousness to your people. And then you'll be approached because they're going to come to you and be like, hold on, brother. Or hold on, sister. Right. You know what I'm saying? I still believe to this day it's a conspiracy what happened to Lauryn Hill. So that's, now, just, that's just my so now, so now, by us trying to bring these conscious rappers to the forefront, mm. What type of position are we putting ourselves in then? You understand what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Um, because we're going up against a big machine. Yeah. You understand? Yeah. We're going up against a strong adversary that realizes the type of music that we want to bring to the forefront mm. is going to be diametrically opposed to the music that they want out there. Definitely. You Definitely. understand? So, I mean... A lot of people may not realize that or even appreciate the risk yeah, that yeah. we take yeah, in trying is. to um, bring this thing to the forefront, yeah. to try to try to give these type of artists the spotlight right. that we think that they is necessary they need, right? and that they deserve, yeah. that our children deserve, yeah. that our future generations deserve. Right. We really don't want our kids growing up, little young girls like that, right. growing up emulating Nicki Minaj. Sure Little indeed. Kim, indeed. you know what I'm saying? I mean, I love those sisters, but the ro their role model status right. is not right. something that I would want my daughter or my grandchild trying to emulate. True indeed. You understand True what indeed. I'm saying? I would want them to emulate a stronger, a stronger image of a black woman. Than what's being put out there for us right now. True so, indeed. you know, when, when we put up the first video on the House of Conscious Battle Rap League, mm. We got a lot of negative comments yeah. and 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 thumbs downs, you know, regarding it. Really? And I'm trying to say to myself, why would somebody who tunes into a conscious YouTube channel be against a conscious battle rap league where we're saying that look, it's, ain't it's I mean, not they, it's not about me disrespecting you. Right. You know what I'm saying right, on right. stage. You're going that information. We're going that information. Just like how you, and you know what gave me the idea? I think it was a um a debate that I want to say Dr. Ali Muhammad and somebody and was it? Uh, nah, nah. It was Dr. Ali Muhammad and I want to say one of the Hebrew brothers. Soccer war. Yeah, one of them. But uh -huh. the point is, 
you know, just, you know, some of the brothers was, you know, just with the language and stuff like that. And that's what gave me the idea, like, you know, as scholars, you know, when you look at brothers like Seti and some of them and, mm -hmm. you know, the brothers are real astute, you know what I'm saying, with the with the knowledge and the history and, right. and digging into information. But I think it takes a, away a lot of from your scholarship when you, you know, fucking crackers, you know, you know what I mean? Right, you know, right, it, it right, takes right, a lot right. away from that. Right. You know, I think, I, I believe I heard Tariq Nasheed speak on that one time too. Mm -hmm. And he mentioned something similar, but the rappers now, I feel like that would be more of a venue where you may hear the F word or N word or whatever, but at the right. end of the day, it's in the context of, right, right, right. It's, it's dropping the jewel on you. Right. You know what I'm saying? It's just not telling somebody something ignorant and, and, and that be it. Right. <laughs> you know right. what I'm saying? Right. So being that real quick, I just want to say the mainstream battle rap now, being that that's like mainstream, because as you've seen the latest BT Hip Hop Awards, you've seen Mook and all of them out there, Calico and Arsenal. Right. That's become mainstream now. Smack is on BT 106 and Park next to Bow Wow and right. shit. You know, being that that's mainstream. Eminem what, 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 is starting a battle rap league. Exactly, Snoop. You know, he got a battle rap league. But the thing is, what we're trying to do right now, this is going to be the new underground, right. the conscious battle rap. Because trust me, when people see it pop off and they see the type of MCs and the type of bars that dudes are spitting and stuff like that, and the type the of talent. knowledge and the talent. It's it's gonna it's gonna you know what I'm saying gain momentum real fast right. you know I th I think that once see there's nothing to oppose mm. what's out there now right right you understand right this is like out the the bat and trust me I don't have a problem with the battle rap that's mm. going on now right. because I take it as entertainment yeah and the brothers in the battle rap. Mm -hmm. arena they take it as entertainment True you understand yeah. you you'll see calico battle somebody mm -hmm. and then right after the battle they boys hanging out yeah. you understand yeah. i mean i don't hung out with some of those cats right you understand right. and the camaraderie amongst them right. 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 is thick right you understand what i'm saying them brothers genuinely appreciate each other because they know what it takes to do what they do at the end of the day they mc they mc them killing they right. none of them doing that right by you doing that you uh -huh. know what i'm saying the message that's going out there the little ones they hear that and they'll really go try it <laughs> right, right right let me say something real quick um let's not get spooked out by the word illuminati right. i'm illuminati mm. illuminati only means the enlightened right. that's all to enlighten the enlightened ones right. you see that's not use it in a spooky sense right. so i just wanted to clear that up oh, yeah. and one more thing brother excuse me for one minute mm. Me and you is getting into the battle. You representing the nation of gods and nerves. I'm under the black power. Right. You got the mic. Well, I'm actually nation of Islam. Five percent right. nation, nation of, Islam. of Islam. All right, set it off. You got you the mic. You coming at me? Yeah. You got the mic right now in the rap battle. Okay. Come on, what you got? What you got for me? We battling right now. Oh, some bars. Oh, yeah, okay, okay. Right I Let's see. Show the people what we talking about. I right, yo. I say yo. You got to come fire. You got to come with the fire, though. I say, yo, all them jewels you say you dropping, I need to see proof of it. You swelling up on the guard like I ain't used to it. The way of Islam is older than the universe. Before the caveman emerged, you ain't know you was first. Giving birth to a ghost is what they do in church. I'm never off on the Sabbath. I'm always doing work. Giving sight to the blind, it ain't an easy task. Watch the snakes when they slide with their greasy ass. I hit the block as a juvie, cause I needed cash. Rolling up with the savages, smoking weed and hash. All praise to the Most High for giving life. Bust shots at them faggot devils for living trife. This is underground railroad rap. You can't address it properly, then the mail goes back. Make sure you stay up out them jail clothes, black. You ain't a gangster, young blood. That's how them pale folks act. You say you G-O-D, I need to see the evidence. You jumping, shouting, and praising, thinking it's reverence. You steady praying to a mystery in the sky. Because what they told you in your history is a lie. I'm spitting high-tech, intelligent bars. You only rap about pushing these irrelevant cars. That China white, they still selling it hard with pounds of green bottled up like relish in jars. You want to bring God back? You got to procreate. You want to sling hard crack? You got to know your fate. 
It's wow easy if a nigga tried to murk you Cause you roll with a bunch of lame squares in your circle You was a silly ass nigga like Urkel I'm trying to bring forth life like the earth do We in the valley of the dry bones I'm shining light, I don't care about your time zone Yeah, everywhere you be the guard is still shine The Asiatic calendar, that's the guard's real time I'm trying to eat so you know that meal's mine You on the road to success but didn't have your wheels aligned We all agree, we living in the last days Little niggas on the Ave trying to blast K's Young chicks walk the strip with they fast ways Your style garbage, it belongs where the trash stays the beast is slick, man, he knows the streets. He's saving money now, cause he's buying souls for cheap. You spit savage bars, some call a gangster rap. But you was a silly nigga, that's not how the gangsters act. I gotta keep the body and the mind purified. I once told a preacher in the church, you a lie. Bumping heads with the guard, you know it's suicide. Cause teaching knowledge itself, it'll get you crucified. I call it knowledge yourself, some call it gospel. I make them demons inside of you get hostile. Look inside yourself and find the cleanest part. Allah designed this universe, man. You ever seen his art? I bills with the guards who throw the meanest darts. I use the sword of truth and stick it through your demons hard. Uh, you in the cipher when you see the red sun. The guards is here so you could tell them devs come. I drop degrees that'll make a preacher's head numb. I'ma bomb him with the Bible. Watch me make the rev run. Yo. Yo, I ain't, yo. I, I, I could go all day long, man. I, yo, man. Yo, cuz. Now you gonna tell us we don't hey. need this shit here? Hey. You, yo, are you out there in Sinatra TV land gonna tell us that these brothers don't need to shine? Yo. You crazy, cuz. Yo. You crazy. You so we gonna wake you up, man. We ready, man. We ready. We take ready. Take we ready. That's what I'm talking about. Yo, that right there, that was fire right there. Now, see, family, ain't nothing wrong with going at your brother like that because you really waking him up. You see what I'm saying? You hitting with, you hitting them with conscious information. You teaching. You teaching through the lyrics. Was that off the head, some of it, or was it was it written? It was written Okay, now see, that's what y'all can do. Y'all can write y'all stuff up, man. Because, yo, this is going to be one y'all don't want to miss. I'm telling you, we coming strong with that. This is my brother right here. You yo, we trying to start this soon, man. One thing with the conscious battle rap, too, I wanted to also mention, when brothers do weigh-ins, that's important. What we trying to start, this is almost like some foolproof type of stuff where you can't just come in and say a word that you heard another conscious brother say and you ain't did the knowledge yourself. You ain't went and studied or researched what it means and you come in the ring or you come in the, the, the event trying to use all type of guard body talking, you're going to get bombed. The weigh-in is an actual debate. What the brothers do with the debating, that's what the weigh-in is. You know what I'm saying? So you'll get to see two MCs finally sit down and, and, and rationalize and talk to each other, debate with each other, whatever. You know what I'm saying? Because I know many times dudes hear MCs spitting. You know, back when I first got knowledge itself, I used to always ask my lightning, yo, such and such, yo, he got knowledge itself? He, he got knowledge itself? Oh, man, yo, he said uh, something, something. He got knowledge itself? And he would have to tell me, nah, nah, he, or yeah, yeah, he do. But with this event, what we're doing is the way in Brothers have to come to the table with their books, At with the their information the on the day of the battle. Whoever go first, they already know who's going to go first. And you get your three-minute rounds or whatever to, to spit your bars. But at that point, it ain't no more talking. At the battle, it's all bars. You see what I'm saying? So, again, this is like something that's foolproof. You can't come in this as a 85 percenter saying you a conscious MC and you want to battle somebody. And you get in the ring with somebody like me, I'm going to chew you up. <laughs> You're saying if you get in the ring with like, like an 85% of getting in the ring with you, oh, yeah. you're going to chew them up. What you mean by that? I'm going to chew them up, meaning that if they get in the ring and they kicking all of this stuff about, you know, let's say whatever, you know, uh, uh, Jesus Christ is, died on the cross and he's my Lord and Savior. Well, I'm going to chew you up because I'm coming at you now with my bars and I'm talking about who is this Jesus Christ figure, you know. When, when did he walk the earth? What did he teach? Who does he represent today? 
<laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm coming at you in all kind of ways, but at the end of the day, I'm teaching. I'm not trying to beat my brother down or whatever, but I'm teaching my brother. In other words, I'm like, dude, go back home and read because you ain't ready yet for these bars. Go back home and study. You know what I'm saying? So it's just a whole nother paradigm that we trying to create. You know what I'm saying? We taught all these gun bars, every bar, you know, dudes talking about I'm a... And they making all these hand gestures with, you know, like they wild out before and poke cats and did all of this wild stuff. We're MCs. We're lyrical. You know what I'm saying? We speak to the people in rhythmic form. That's what we do. You know what I'm saying? So, like I said, brother, you know, it's just going to be something for the eyes to behold. That's all I can say. You know what I'm saying? i known this young brother right here Hotel. since he was a young brother. That's right. That's a Are you still writing or you ain't writing no more? I'm just doing poetry now. That's it. That's you know it. what we're getting ready to start? A conscious battle rap league. Wow. <laughs> poetry too. Okay, so buddy. you definitely involved. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. So we getting ready to start a conscious battle rap league wow. because what we trying to do is take our rap back That's and right. put it in the hands of our people. Right. You see what I'm saying? So if we do the conscious battle rap league, yeah. we're going to be getting to start raising and waking up the young brothers and teaching them through our lyrics. All right. My man right here, yeah. he used to spit some crazy bars. Check it out. We're going to do it like this. We deal with pyramid experiments, hieroglyphic embezzlement, Swahili bilingo, solidifying intelligence. My great God, ultraviolet spit sun rays, four ways, mind, body, and soul when the gun sprays. Executive order, Rich Porter, the man slaughtered. Communist regimes, Fidel's Castro's new order. 99 elements, universal apocalypse. The God transvene through nickel bags of eloquence. Armageddon, biological celestial weapons. Chemical warfare supplied them adolescents. With Cyclone B, his city Jews turn. OG, 33 in the third Masonic order, blow green leaves. Messiah, Elijah Muhammad, Mark McGuire, never land. The color man, murder and rape for power. Columbus, guns are relentless when convincive. Promiscuous, 180 degrees shaped offensive. Subtract, angelic illuminist that sell crack. Look back, prison and pain had us all trapped. We live in a dream, like the thoughts of a dope thing. The crime and times when bullets blasted my state greens. Sophisticate the equilibrium, the earthquake, it's a heartbreak. We pull each other down with self hate. Let me demonstrate those Cyrus, Mr. Reed's immaculate. It's irrelevant to talk about the next when you sell of it. Self love, orientate Chinese back rubs. There's no love. Hell is on earth where we bust slugs. I sold drugs and felt the rain of the gun flames. We talk game and tell the feds know our first name. Soda. Your mind is on another planet like the Land Rover I'ma split your atoms straight to the white meat I'm down to put the flamer to these crackers white sheets I know what I'm saying might enrage the devil's wild move Like the Tin Man, I stays with the metal We gon' get free or die trying You selling drugs in the hood to get rich, you gon' die trying Dr. King said we gon' be free, that nigga died lying Catch a fed case with cracking guns and die frying you serving balls like a tennis bout You got Dutch juice stuffed in the jar Like it's a Guinness stout I ain't Dennis but I used to take the menace route Roll two L's and I'm cool with a J in the house This year the guards don't got no pity for ya We coming through dropping bombs getting gritty for ya The G-O-D's is coming at ya The G-O-D's is here The G-O-D's is coming at ya Staring at the card in the flesh, you know you in the red zone Why you can't produce any bars, you in the dead zone You spit foolishness that kills people My wise words lift you high in the sky, just like a real eagle G-O-D spell backwards is dog That's you and your click, I eat scraps of the hog Yo, for savages, I used to walk with night sticks But nowadays, for the hounds, you better have a nice clip Y'all niggas acting like y'all wanna fight, prick Mess around, I'ma body your dogs like Mike Vick mm. The guard was walking on the border For under a stack, niggas will come through Hawking on your daughter Listen up, you deserve the truth The only good in doing bids is you preserve your youth 
Mm-hmm. You got drunk, that's why you swerved the coupe. Every bar you hear me spit, you know the words is new. Yeah. Yeah. Hey.